first thing we're gonna do. It's locked. I'm locked from the inside. I don't think that's going to work. Thanks. I don't think that's going to work. BTFO. Yeah, I'm getting BTFO. Um, okay. So what do I want? What do I want? Yes, I want that. Can't carry anything else. Oh my god, I can't even pick up Pickle Rick. Uh, right okay, so this is a key in here. So essentially, you have water. So you sit Mr. Key in here, and then you pour the solvent in. Uh, however, you can't just pick it up because you're oh, not an idiot. Locked again. So you can use this. Cool. I hope it still works. Cool. Cool. All right. And now everything is yeah, cool. Everything's actually used up. Good. Okay. So yeah, that's that. Now we're going to use key to room three hundred three. Excellent. And then we're gonna head back to. Actually, I still I still don't have a uh, antidote, so we can't go to 101 quite yet. But that's okay. We can use a couple. Um, we can use a couple pieces in here. Uh, right. So I'm gonna use. I hope I can get in the motel on this floor. I'm gonna use the 305. First, we're gonna head over here find this baby. That's like the second to last one I found. Because they get a little tricky on you. It's locked. I do like how every time you have to check in, you have to check for him to say, it's locked. I also like the very weird lighting on the right edge of every single door. <laughs> I don't know what the deal with it is, but it is every single door. Oh, this is neat. <laughs> okay. What if that was Scissor Man playing on the piano? Dude, that'd be so based. Hey, I have a bathroom key. I th think this. Do you need. Yeah, you do need one for this, then, too. So, this is the second one you actually need it for. Whoa, it's sheet music. It's like I'm actually there. Nothing there. I will suffer. I just like what the evil one is just like. Mm -hmm. Suffer! So yeah, you get that anyway. I would like to get like one antidote, please. How's my? You know what? I literally do not need it. Okay, this is another neat little puzzle. Neat, neat little puzzle, you know. A jar full of honey. Mm -hmm. That's very specific. Okay. Alright, so we are going to violin. Give the world's tiniest violin. Then we are going to put the L sheet music go on here. Then we're gonna push him closer. Damn, the book's ready to play. You shake my nerves and you rattle my brain. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Essentially the same thing. So this is like the key to get out of here. Alright. Also, there was no music on it. Dun 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 dun. This game also shouldn't be called Oxide. It should be called Key Simulator. Pretty much, door slash key simulator. Um, I kind of, in a weird way, I kind of like it. It's like each puzzle is like contained in its own thing, and it's you're the idiot if you can't like. You know, yeah. and obviously Spencer's making this look a lot easier because he knows exactly. Dude, the way. first time I played it, it took me forever. All right, so we are also. I could I could finish the game literally right now, but it's locked. I do not want to. Okay, I have nine. Good, because I was like, man, if there's an enemy in here and I only have six, that's pretty brutal. I am hoping to find an antidote in here, because I would just like to be able to do that. Okay. I don't think there's anything really special. It's a small wooden box. Oh, dang, dude, really? Alright, 
So, yeah, I don't think there's anything, like, special in here. I also feel as if all the narration that this guy does can just be done with just text and make it so much more immersive. Yeah. Like, when you play Silent Hill, Heather isn't being like, every single thing and voicing it. Oh, I do. This one might have an enemy in it. Try to run away from that and I can Okay. I'm trying to show off literally everything in this game that I can. Even like like this leads to like literally nothing? What is this? Oh, that's cool. Oh, okay. Yeah, so um, essentially what they're saying with this is you can either go to room 301 or 305, and you either get the padlock or the um, the bolt cutters. So that's pretty, that's, pretty, that's pretty neat. And again, it's just it goes to show you that this game has many, many ways to go through it. Now, the only negative thing is is we are going to go back to room uh, to the, the floor 200s, because I do want to show off a couple more... Um, couple more uh, specific rooms in here. I can get in the hotel on this floor. Yes, you can. We could finish the game in five seconds. I just want to make sure I'm not taking too much of Dred's time. No, we're all right. Because uh, this might surprise you, but the ending is uh, fine. Is that the word I'm looking for? Quick. <laughs> yeah, let's go. At the very least, I do want to, even if I'm not showing every single room in here, I do want to get to that one specific one we were talking about before. It's locked. Oh, that's right. I have to... Wait. Oh, yeah. Um, do I have the key for that one? I don't know if you ever get a key for that one. All right. Do not be right here, please. <laughs> Got him! Do you have one key in your storage? Yes, okay. thank you, thank you. Once I show this, once I show the one, uh, the one room, I'm perfectly content. I, like I said, I don't have to do, uh, I don't have to do everything by any means. I hope I can get into but I hope that I've showed that there's a bunch of different ways you can go, you can go about this. This game is epic for the win. It is truly, <laughs> truly epic. Okay. So we're going to head over here. We're going to get rid of all the dumb stuff we don't need. See if we have an antidote in here. Do I? Oh, yeah, we have three. Holy, holy crap. Da, 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 da. Holy crap. Da, da, da. All right, so that almost fills us up. But I, I actually tried to look up Leg Leg or Leg Devin uh, a couple Devin. months ago. I could not find the videos at all. I think I think lost media. I think it's literally lost media. Also, I do like how, and I know this is a really small thing, but they keep the keys in the door to kind of show you if you get like lost. Like, what rooms have I been already? Remember when Leg Leg was first place in uh, Sweet Child of Mine for like a day? I, Good times. I do remember that because he figured out the route about using star power in the three note chords because GH two actually gives you notes for chords. Hey, we did it. What? You didn't even have to use the antidote. Well, I didn't know because what? there were three God. choices. There were three choices. There were three choices. <laughs> I died. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. All right, so we are going to do. Yeah, this is like literally like half as long as as the loading screens usually are. They're usually pretty, pretty, pretty bad. So close. I have to go on. All right, so let's go to one oh nine, which should be right over here. Also, I feel as if nowadays um, Unreal is becoming the new like Unity. As really? As that sounds, because Unreal changed their pricing structure to like you can use it for free, but if you sell a game of Unreal, they take royalties. Uh, I think it's like ten percent or something like that. So 
for like super huge games, that's like a huge blow. But for like indie games, like a lot of people are just using Unreal because like whatever. Okay, so you can't just buy like Unreal Engine. Like they're yeah. like, nope, just they're doing that on purpose because by pay or whatever. it means that Unreal is much more obtainable for small developers. But then they take like a much much bigger cut from huge uh, corporations. Uh, can I just... So uh, it's like a win-win for Unreal. Can I just pour a, pour a 40 up for the... It stopped. It is PM. Can, yeah, can, can, I, can I pour out a 40 for all the awful... Uh, how bad I feel for all the um, giant corporations? Yeah, dude. I feel awful. In my in my free time, I defend Disney. Me too, all actually. The time. Thank you. I love when they do stuff. All right, so um, this is pretty neat. There are uh, two different ways that you can go about finding out this uh, this uh, puzzle. You can. I would I would like it if there wasn't an enemy in here. That'd be epic. Old radio that doesn't work. No. Oh, this was the third to last one that I uh, found because uh, it's kind of hidden a little bit. Anyway, so there's two ways you can go about this. You can do all this crap and then find these like coins and stuff, and then you get this key to this thing, or you can use my old friend. Just a brick. I'll call you can Josh. use my old friend Josh. Okay. <laughs> It just spawns an enemy. Oh, five! Wow. Okay, and then you get this. And so that was, what was that? 11, 21, 34. It's a key. It looks like the key. One of the rooms. Oh, sweet. That's the one I wanted. Awesome. Yeah, 209 is the very, like, unique one to this playthrough. So I'm going to show 209 and then we'll get out of here because I know I've taken enough time on this already. And some of the room, a lot of the rooms that are left are just like, it's a room. There's an enemy in it. Okay, cool. All right, so we do so have to very have to quickly on. run up here and just get that name tag. Um, I'm not going to show it, but if you try to go through to room 209 without the name tag, you just keep, um, I would say this, you just keep, um, falling back over and over again, like you'll just enter into the place that you were. And they'll, they'll, there is a reason for it, which I'll show you real quick. Um, it, there's like a construction sign on the outside, which kind of hints at like, hey, what's, uh. What could you possibly use that for? This is like, oh, like ID, ID required. So we have our ID. So we're good to use this. And then we'll actually go through room 209. Otherwise, you just go in and then you enter out the exact same place you are if you don't have that ID. Which is pretty, pretty, pretty neat. Now, on all the other playthroughs, you don't need the ID. Uh, but uh, we're fancy. Yep, we're good. That counted. I can't believe that counted. Mm, that was cool. What's this one? Spare key. Oh, yeah! Oh, that's so cool! So we already, uh... I'm sorry, Trev, I'm not gonna get you the, uh... The, uh... What you call it? The the platinum. No. I know. A I know. Eggs. A dozen eggs. <laughs> yes. You have to eat all the eggs. <laughs> you have to eat all the eggs. I want to. Uh, the doctor better say that. You have. <clears throat> you have to eat all the eggs. Or I'm gonna chop off your leg. <laughs> Okay, so, um, 
Yeah, this is this is really cool. Um, if you look at this game kind of like a flow chart, where it starts out with the three different ways you can take. Uh, getting the key from the ground, getting the key from just that the one that's handed to you, and getting the key from the pool. Uh, essentially, this is another way to so go about to go getting to the... Um, the one I didn't get to show you, which is kind of neat, is this requires a gas mask. And when you go in, it's just like a first-person view with you with a gas mask on. But beyond that, there's nothing really special about it. And I know I've been taking up a lot of time anyway, so I'm just going to continue on this. Um, if you remember, we went through room 202, and to get to room 203, we had to go through that whole that whole nonsense. If you go that route, you just get the spare key to room 203. <coughs> and you can go past that, uh, you can bypass the having to go past that enemy and having to go, um, having not to shoot and all that stuff. So again, for the little universe this game is set in, I very much appreciate that stuff. But let's go finish the game. We got this. We got this. Level. It is pretty cool that there's like it seems like there's like two solutions to like everything. Yeah, yeah, and it's like it's like each room is its own puzzle, but the way you go about the rooms, like the the order in which you do the rooms, like even here, they gave you three hundred five and three hundred one, yeah. and you could do once you realize that you don't have to do both, like you know, for like uh, for playing it multiple times, it uh, it certainly. Uh, Certainly makes it easier. But again, I just wanted to show off all I could. The only unique room you didn't see was the gas mask one. But like I said, all it is is just a normal room, but you have a gas mask on. get in the hotel on this floor. Yeah. Hey, baby. Nice eye kind of sticking out. Which one do I have? Hey, baby! Oh. Alright, cool. I just want to make sure there's nothing there. And, yeah. Okay. So we are perfectly fine. We have, what, nine, and we get more in here. Yeah, we're probably good. Whee! On the right path! Which, like, when I first read that, I was like, oh, I'm, uh, like, 50% done or whatever. It's like, now nah, you're, like, 95% done. But uh, the the whole game is 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 in which way do you go about getting to the third floor? It is weird that the achievement is called on the right path. Right? It should be like after you exit the one wall. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Ah. That's it. Okay. I didn't even have to do that. I just did that in stuff. All right. Is there... If there are any more things to pick up, I would like to because there is an enemy. All right. Let's see. Uh, oh wait, there's still a couple at the bottom. I was gonna say, let's see how many how many we got just through this first playthrough, just messing around. And uh, I just want to say, trust me, you're not missing out much with these documents. They're, like, as Englishy as this is, and they, like, even me reading them all in a row, I was like, okay, sounds good. Alright. What's that? Yes! Alright. Hey, baby. My head... Uh, hello. <laughs> so this is weird. This is this is like just to set up having that enemy be out there. Shit. Now, when you kill that enemy or when you get past it, they they refer to it as evil. So like I'm guessing that the oxide killed your friend or whatever and made it into this weird evil thing. I don't really understand but uh, uh, one thing i did want to mention is this enemy if you play through on the third or fourth attempt this is a common enemy uh in like every room which again goes to show you how much harder it is whereas this is like kind of like the final boss so to say oh shit 
feel like you're headed here. Uh, how about we walk through this door? Failed, failed attempt meaning, uh, evil tried to get us. Oh god. Okay, I have two. Good. Okay. Alright, so this is a very specific thing that we have to do. What is this? What is this? Okay. Yes. So we're gonna take Fine. this. We're gonna take this. Oh, Molotov cocktail. Yeah. Now, you're supposed to uh, use the Molotov cocktail to throw it at the thing. There is another way you can go about it. The fire is really strong. Oh, oh, oh. You can take the Molotov cocktail and, like, light it here, but it is not advised because you only have, like, a second to throw it. Whereas with this, you can, I think, just... Yeah. And this is, like, much more safe, I guess. But again, there's two different ways you can go about it. Okay, so we got that. This room's comfy, by the way. It's a comfy room. Good choice. Which is telling me, hey, you didn't mess around with the other thing. Banana. Zero out of ten, this game sucks. Ha 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 ha! I'm evil. I have control of your life. I didn't read any. All right, what do we get? 15 out of 18, 16 out of 18, 14 out of 20, a 0 out of 11. Those are all at the last second anyway. That's actually not bad for, like, a random playthrough. Oh, my God. This game just hands out trophies. Shit. So this is weird. This is, like, something they just threw in at the last second. So it's the thing that was following you, but not really. You only saw it at the very first second. Apparently, this is supposed to be Eva, like the girl you came with, and I guess Oxide, like, ruined her? I don't know. Hi. It's also the thing that's on the front cover of the game. There's parts of this game I actually really like, but then other parts that are, like, really bad. Yeah. Shit. No, I absolutely agree. So this, this part's kind of neat. Um, so... And again, I say kinda because I gotta say, if I bought this game for thirty bucks, I'd be pissed. So R one makes you go faster. You have to you have to stop at these things. And again, it's not anything special by any means, but at least it's something. You like my you like how my arms move. I would be interested in trying out something else that this that this company makes, you know. Watch this. Eh, they throw you. Eh? Because this is a good... I, I don't know if this is their first experience, but this is, like, pretty solid for, like, a true indie title. But I agree with Trav. It should be 15 maybe 20 bucks. Maybe. Also, I don't understand what the whole purpose of that is because, like, all right... You went around in a circle, you saw Eva, but now you're back in this room. And then all you do now at this point is just leave, which this wasn't here before. Again, I don't yes. understand. You needed it. <laughs> Shit. That's impossible. This character It's because you're in oxide, bro. Uh hey. So yeah, there's about two minutes left of gameplay in this game. So my timing would be okay. Yeah, my wow. timing's all right. I'm, I want a little like over. You fried your brain after all. I best get out of here before your stench fills the air. Yes, sir. Oh, what is this? Seems like someone has taken a walk through my laboratory. What a permission. You stay also, no matter how many times I beat this game, I don't understand who's taking the walk through the laboratory. Right. Dead people don't move. Get it? <laughs> Goddamn fool. What, 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 did, what did I do? Oh, oh, where is that fucking crackpot? Notice we have all of our... So if you get to this point um, with... You can get to this point except for the very last playthrough. However, you can't escape if you have one or two um, limbs missing because he's just too slow to get past the doctor. So this is this is apparently Eva, who's also in Oxide right now, which is, I guess, like the, the Matrix or something. I don't know. Yeah, so this is where all the dock ones are. 
I'm gonna get Trev a trophy. He's gonna care so much. A couple years when he looks at this, he'll be like, wait, what? What was Oxide 104? When did I play that? Do you remember that really crappy horror game, White Day, that we played a couple years ago? Yep. I remember the trophies for that game being ludicrous. Oh, dude, that game, because it was so annoying to go through, I would never yeah, get the that, that game was literally just RNG jump scares. Zero out of ten fun. Yeah, I had no fun with that game. Did I, did I get them all? I I... Oops, sorry. Five out of eleven, huh. Maybe you have to do it on a different playthrough to get the rest. I don't know. Don't care. Whoa, it's like I'm really there at the saw. And we're going to crouch, which is officially, like, the last thing you do in this game. I think this is... No, 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 there's one more thing you do. I was going to say, that might be one they call the speed run. I told you not to move. Why doesn't anyone listen to me? Now, notice that you're, like, running away from him. But if, like, yeah, if you're, like, dying, you'd have no time at all. Okay. So this is, this is a trophy I didn't get the first time. What? How did that padlock get on there? This is a trophy I didn't get the first time, but it's hilarious. Hello? Hi? Oh, I thought I had to do it. Because I thought you have to, like, literally pick the item up, but... <laughs> what is this guy doing? <laughs> Peace. Fuck. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Oh, here's where they are. Fuck. <laughs> I will find you and rip you open. Trav, I got so many trophies for you, you don't even know. Hold me your hand. Bye bye Well, you were kind of Dude, dumb. 10 out of 10 voice acting. <laughs> Fool! <laughs> <coughs> so, yeah, this is the only way that you can escape, because I think that even with one appendage missing, he catches you. Two, he definitely catches you. Yeah, because I think, I think the first thing he cuts off is one of your legs. Yeah. So you were yeah. so screwed. Yeah, yeah. And, uh... That is Oxide uh, 104. I can't wait for the sequel. Oxide 105. Where they explain the guy in the laboratory. Yeah, the... the oh, oh, oh. This is the Thanos appearance. What do you want to know? I lost a test subject because of Eva. And they haven't had what you could call a good day. You kind of lost your hand, bro. I'm sorry. I apologize. It's just that fucking bit. No, no. I won't talk about her again like that. I wish money was this guy paid. I, I there wasn't anything more than $500. Depend on you. Or it's a developer himself. Don't worry, ma'am. <gasps> this won't be a problem. I don't think you'll get out of the forest alive. <gasps> okay. I'll handle everything. I won't fail you. There's somebody bigger than the doc. And she's a girl. And that's it. Can't wait for Oxide 2. What a... <laughs> what an ending. The ending is... Yeah. Because, like, it, it... But again, look at the amount of people here. Yeah. It's well, very... I mean, incredibly low budget. In, in fact, uh, there you go. Barry Dunn did both Matthew and the doc. There you go. It's very surprising that we've got a, uh... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Special thanks about 10 people. So that's maybe 30 people. If you include... Special thanks a lot of times is, like, wives or husbands yeah. of, like, people work on it, so... So I guess, I guess they're, I guess they're, I guess they're Spanish for the, for the dubbing. Alright, well that's it. That's Oxide 104. I'm really glad that we had the time to go through the whole thing. I wanted to do this one for a while now, and I'm especially excited to show to, to have shown you in the beginning uh, the um, the fact that the game is completely different without the update, which just, again, that's kind of, like, imagine 15 years from now when, like, the PS5 or PS4 isn't online anymore, 
and like facts will be completely different for the dude, game. Dude, so many games. So many games. Are and like be that's not that's not just over. the the update wasn't just being like, oh, quality of life stuff like the graphics. It was like the the actual gameplay part was different. That finger from the beginning isn't in the isn't in the game with the update. So again, very cool, very weird. I hope you enjoyed Oxide and bye.